Hello everyone, welcome today to the topic energy balance. Uh, also just uh, in advance, uh, next time we go in energy, in energy efficiency. So it's just that you know, and so we start uh, like, yeah, what is the meaning of energy balance? It means the we look that the body comes in harmony by the spirit and body so also with the yin and yang this means when the, our body is in balance we are in a good healthy state and also we have enough uh, vital energy like we feel very powerful the whole day from morning this evening and also like uh, our immune system is very on a high level so we don't really can get sick anymore so all what is imbalance it can become sick and so on. Uh, yeah, when we are completely balanced, uh, nothing can happen in a way. <laughs> so there we can start like with the yang and the yin principle of, of the harmony of the body. So first of all, all the things what I say now is a big aspect. We take this big aspect and then put it in this yang or yin. Huh? Then everything has both in it, just a bigger aspect of one. Huh? So we just start and you see like uh, activity, yang. Uh, quietness, yin. Uh, eating, yang. Fasting, yin. Huh? Uh, thoughts, yang. Free mind, yin. Warm, yang. Cold, yin. Simple, huh? Uh, like stress, yang. Relaxation, yin. Pam pam. So this is some main topic we take today. So we start like. Uh, what I said before, in everything have both, like when we go in food, in nutrition, this means like from the Chinese medicine, there we have like uh, every time the yang and yin food, so every food have one aspect more, and so you can check with nutrition that you get there the balance, what you put in. But the big aspect is we eat something, we put it down in our system, and our system have to work to bring the energy out and put everywhere the things what he need from the food. So it's a big work, so it's young. Hmm? The, the other one is like fasting, so completely yin. But there we see like when our system doesn't work, then uh, still the body start to clean. And the, when the body start to cleaning, then it's like young again, but the main part is quiet. So less, yin, uh, less young, more, uh, <laughs> yeah, less young, but more yin. Huh? The cleaning is just more in a soft nature way. And the big food is like, <laughs> the system have to work like crazy. And this is same with the activity and quietness. So. Like uh, from we start from quietness, something like very soft, to like nothing meditation, to to then meditation, qigong, yoga, tai chi, walking, bicycling, running, swimming. So yeah, it's also <laughs> what you do how intensive. Huh? So also fitness from is from here to here. So it's a lot of option and also how we breathe how, how we have a low uh, stomach breathing the deep one or we have just the chest breathing like here less efficient very efficient huh? the deep one brings fill up our two side of the lung when we just breathe in it's just like and the one side goes like so Deep breathing brings more energy and low breathe, deep one brings more quietness also in the activity. So you, you see like there 
it can also get more efficient but this is the next topic for next next week huh? or next time <laughs> so there you see all the things how we have to find the balance between what we do what we consume and also when i do today nothing like in the evening i just relax but in the next day i go running i still have the balance and that is really the big topic we have to find with all the things balance when we have in every day like the perfect balance we can do every day perfect balances yes yeah <laughs> what i should say is just good but in the reality is like every day is a little bit different sometimes so we have to look on the whole week and bring there the balance with activity and quietness and also with food like uh, we eat today too much eh? never forget this so we have to check again for fasting and like intermediate fasting eating in the morning and lunch and then in the evening nothing and no snacks eh? then we have like to the next morning a long time without food and our body can refresh and clean and the other way is also like every Sunday as example when you don't work like just on your free day uh, then you can also do fasting the whole day or you can start Saturday evening you eat something and Sunday you start when you get hungry again or you can also do eating the Sunday morning and maybe lunch and then do nothing to the next morning on Monday uh, mostly more the easy way is like eating Saturday evening and then just when you get hungry on Sunday, you start. But be careful with hungry. <laughs> mostly our system just trick us. Mostly we are not hungry. We just want some snacks or something. Be careful about this. And yeah, there is like the step how we can find balance between like yang and being. This, this is how we have to observe ourselves and see what is more yang, what is more yin to find the, the balance uh, then uh, our heart circulation, our heart system uh, from the most today is too fucked up in a way huh? it's very like the most people don't make something for condition training like stamina training, huh? stamina training, uh, running, bicycling, uh, swimming, uh, walking uh, jumping rope or yeah whatever like something uh, active and that is the big problem also then again like that when we do something like running that we don't make the heat <laughs> running like fast and then slow and fast and slow it's good for our heart system but it gives us stress stress again so when we have in the whole day stress and we make something in the evening and there we have also stress again it's also not good we go out of balance so there is the meaning that may we run just in a, uh, in a speed is good for this day so on some days maybe i'm faster on the other day i'm a little bit slower but we can clean our mind and be still make stamina training there you see everywhere you can optimize uh, what's what the thing big thing is what I forgot like it's also about the stadium you are so when you optimize your whole energy your whole system uh, you have you have to eat less you have to sleep less and all becomes more efficient you win more energy in more everything you start to do so for many people it's sometimes normal things very hard like walking a whole day many people uh, just get tired and when you come more forward you don't get tired anymore it's just walking and this is with all the things so there we can make a big difference with the energy balance to the energy efficiency. So bring the balance, 
and optimize. So we go then next to the next video, like in the key efficiency. You have more questions to the balance, just write in the comment and I make a next video about special topics about whatever you want. And when you have also all the topic, just ask me and I try to give a solution or whatever, or my view. And yeah, this was all for today. All the best. See you next time. Take care. And I hope you get a step closer to your balance. Just observe and make the steps. See you.